Hi guys, CC here once again to bring you another beginner tutorial on Pocket Maple Story. Today I want to show you about macro. Uh, what exactly is a macro? Uh, where to find it and how to set it up and how to use it. So I am on my Xenon today, and to begin with, what exactly is a macro? I like to see macro as a combination keys for skills. So if you have two or three buffs, instead of putting them into separate shortcuts, you can put them into one macro and shortcut into your shortcut slots. Then you just need to press one keys instead of two keys. Um, so where is macro? If you want to go to your skill list, uh, first of all, not all skill can be set up into macro. Only some skills can be set up into macro. So, if you see the skill that has this macro function right on top, that means it can be set up into macro. Here I will show you how to set up a macro. You want to go to the select a skill that has this macro function and press it. And then, for example, we want to set up this buff along with another skill. So let's select this buff and then put it in the number one slot. That number one slot means that it will be casted first. So if you want your attack skill to be casted first, you want to put that in that first slot. But we want the buff to go first, so let's press, put it in the first slot. And then let's select this attack skill and put it in the second slot. And then press confirm. We want to go back to the macro, see it's uh, safer in this shield symbol. That shield symbol doesn't really mean anything, it just a uh, picture to show you that which uh, you set up in this shortcut. So we want to put this shield symbol to shortcut in our shortcut keys. We want to select a shortcut and press the slots that we want it to be. So it's right here with this short symbol. See when we press it, uh, press the short, the macro that we set up, you see my Xenon casts the buff first and it does the attack. Okay, so let's go back. Let's go back to macro. If we want to remove it, it's same thing as removing the skills. You just uh, select the same skill and then press it at the same slots that will remove that completely and then you just confirm and that means that this macro no longer have that skill see when I press it, it doesn't do anything because it, it doesn't have any skill registered in that macro so lastly what are some situations that you can set up macro just for convenience sake that you don't have to press two or three keys is for buff. For example, Mercedes have uh, at least three buff, uh, two buff, depend on your skill build. So you can set up uh, all your buff into one macro, then you can just press one key to cast all the buff. So in the case of Xenon today that I'm showing, uh, I want to show you a macro that is set up for Xenon. It can be useful for beginner Xenon for the skill attack. So Xenon doesn't have a lot of buff, but this macro that I set up, I set up with the pin missile, the rocket, what is it? The pinpoint rocket on the first slot and an attack skill on the second slot. I'm just using the beginner, the first job skill 
to demonstrate you here. So with this combo, you can go up to the monster and by just pressing one skill you can attack and the missile will continue to fire. So it's a really really good macro to use when you are training instead of just uh, pressing one skill or pressing one the skill and the rocket you can put it into one to cast the skills for your training that will be all for today's beginner tutorial on macro if you haven't subscribed to my channel consider subscribing to my channel for more pocket Mingo story videos and then Hit that like button if my videos are helping you out and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!